Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Dear viewers, in previous tutorial on global RFEM, you have seen how to model complex surfaces. In this tutorial, I will show how to import 3D surface model from AutoCAD to global RFEM very easily. We can model these complex surfaces in global RFEM manually if we have the coordinates for modeling this complex shapes but if we want to import the whole model from AutoCAD 3D file then we can do it very easily now I will show how to do that on if you want to model this manually you can follow the procedure which I have shown in previous tutorial on Kamlapur railway station before going to that I want to tell about the website of Decode BD. You can go to the website by typing decode-bd.com. From here, you can check tutorial page. Here, there will be new uploads and other featured tutorials linked to YouTube. Resources the resources we have used in youtube tutorials here you will get those resources and some other useful resources you will get here then you can go to discussion page for asking any questions here you can type your question i will try to give the answer you can see the blog in the blog i will try to post important articles every day so you can check the blog now we will go to the tutorial so now let's see how to import this full 3d model from AutoCAD to global RFEM First, we have to save this DWZ file as DXF file. This one, Opera Sydney, save. Now, close this one. Now, we will go to import. There are different options for importing 3d model from different software and different format i will go for dxf format because i am importing 3d model from autocad file click on ok go to that folder where we have saved that dxf file this this same file before I have exported as DXF file. So I'm selecting this one. Open. see the whole model imported in global RFEM as it was modeled in AutoCAD as surface element those elements surface elements imported in global RFEM very easily this is large complex model imported very easily on global RFEM we can change the model color surface by geometry surface thickness so in this way we can change our model color
if the model has been done properly in AutoCAD then the imported model will be perfect using this model we can do analysis and design for this shell surfaces we can check the properties of surface edit surface here we can see the surface properties here the thickness here material properties from here we can change the material properties okay and we can view this model in rotating mode here right click auto rotate model see here this model we can view like this now we can stop so in this way we can import very large and complex 3d model from autocad to global rfm so thanks for watching stay tuned for more upcoming important tutorials press the bell icon on the youtube app and never miss another update